Welcome back to Spiral 1, Spiral 2 Reignited. Today we actually cover the first real stage, first, <laughs> well, not the first real, the first two stage, well, the second and third stages of Summer Forest, Idle Springs, and Colossus. Interesting note, and this is something I have pointed out in my Let's Play of the, of, of, of these games. Basically, almost every level in two are basically tied together. Isle Springs and Colossus are two are together because Colossus was supposed to be. I forgot Col about that. Yeah. Was, yeah. What? No. This stage was actually supposed to be called Colossus Springs. Certain um, certain world ties are are kept in the main game, but others are removed. I miss the fact that they have a big heart that appears over that guy's head. Yeah, I was just gonna say that. Poor, still, after all these years, that poor guy, he just, like, just, oh. <laughs> and I will say this, I love, like, the, they, they kept the introductions to each level Agreed. in the game. Like, you know, like, they're, they're remastered, of course, but they still look just as funny as they were, like, in the original game. Oh, uh, oh, agreed. And unfortunately, this is the first level. This is the second yeah, time think... we have to revisit a visit a level. Oh, really? Yeah, we need swimming. Oof. Ah, still such a good game. I it love is. this. I think Idle Springs was one of my favorite levels, honestly. Yeah, I, I it's not bad. I in terms of summer forest, I like the aesthetic of Sunny Beach more. Yeah. Interesting note. They actually changed the um, the shields of those enemy of the uh, little shield enemies in this game. They're now barbecue lids. Oh yeah! Don't they also like wave like? Yeah, they have like hot dogs on sticks that they and, wave at you. Yeah, the first guy had marsh had a marshmallow. Yeah, I forgot about that. Like it. See, it's these little changes that they've done. I really like. Yeah. It, yeah, it, it, it suits that level, honestly. Yeah, it gives them charm. And honestly, I feel that if Insomniac mm -hmm. was behind this, they would have done the same thing. Mm -hmm. Oh, definitely. Toys for Bob, like, they did a really good job with, like, both this and the Crash trilogy. Yeah. Uh, Crash was Vicarious. I thought Toys for Bob did Crash, too. No. No, Crash was. Are you like, sure? Yeah. Yeah, Crash Band. Yeah, re, yeah. Insane Trilogy was was a vicarious, and this is Toys for Bob. Also, weird note: if in this occurs in both the original and the and this version, if you if you save that guy in a in a weird angle, he'll basically run a complete lap around that spot. Oh, yeah, I don't I guess understand why. Right. I don't know why I thought of that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's sorry like, about that. I don't know why. Well, I it's both. It's still both Activision. It's still Activision for both yeah. of them. Sadly, I don't think we'll be getting another Spiral game because mm -hmm. Toys for Bob is in the is in the Call of Duty mines, and it seems Activision wants to focus on Crash. Yeah, um, I saw some, speaking of Crash, I saw some gameplay for, like, that Wampa League game. It does not excite me at all. <laughs> what are they doing to my poor Bandicoot? Uh, you assholes could have gone to Spyro 4. You're pretty tough. If you ever want a permanent job, yeah. we've got a place for you here. But, for the but moment, no, like, Activision just decided to throw them into, like, the... <laughs> Call it duty. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I'm happy that we at least got Crash 4 out of it, like before. But, you know, Spiral 4 would have been a really nice thing, too. Yeah. I don't understand why they, re why they have that random area that just leads you to the second area. It's really weird. Yeah. 
Oh, yeah. That whistling reminds me. So, which one of us is going to do Rayman? Um, you can if you want. God damn it. Unless you want me to do it. <laughs> I don't want to do the first game. Um, I can try and do the first game, but w mark my words, I will probably fail at it and I'll probably rage quit. <laughs> Yeah, this how, about is... we, how about we let Edgy do it? <laughs> oh, God. You have to do this all in a complete lap, in a complete loop. Otherwise, the um, the monster thing will just knock the hula girls straight back to their pedestals. I forgot about that. Yeah. And they just wow! They just murdered someone. They do a, they do a flip. They do a jump in a fl in a spin in the air when the lightning strikes in the original. It's like that's just why did you remove that? Yeah. Also, why were you chained up anyway? <laughs> Sacrifice. Do you really think that this game would go go that dark? Yeah. I don't. I can see Crash doing that. Doing that is a bit of a joke, but not Spyro. Oh, I can. I can see. I can definitely see them doing that with Spyro, honestly. Okay, since we're talking about old video games and that, um, you know what I actually found at the library? What? A medieval comic book. Oh wow! Like, based on medieval. Yeah, so it's actually. It actually takes place. Right after the events of the second game. Interesting. I still have to. I still have to finish reading it, but I saw like the like, I saw the cover like it's you know it's Sir Dan and I'm like, yep, yeah, my. That is really. In when was this? When was when was it made? Um, I gotta like look up after and find out, but I'll look it up. I can probably let you know in the next video. I'll look it up right now. Hang on, what is it? Cause I think there's a few actually, honestly. Huh, this came out during the, um, well, well, I think, I don't know if this is the same thing, thing, but it's like, apparently this came out in nine, in two, tw in, uh, 2009. Yeah, it sounds I'm, about uh, right. 2019, I gotta, 2019, like, look at not 2009. That. I don't know why I said that. Yeah, yeah, that's really weird. Yeah, yeah. It was probably made for the um, for the, after the remake. It was, I think, I think it was to tie in with the remake, honestly. But yeah, but it's yeah. Also, do not worry well, about the gems that fell into the water from the rocket. Those gems stay there. Those gems are still in, still underwater even if you leave. Even in the original version, those gems st stay there. Okay, I gotta say, I love this part here. Like, they're all terrified. He's like, Rrr. He takes out a stick. He's like, can I join you guys? <laughs> it's, it's like, what? I want to join. Can't I join? <laughs> I love that. Yeah, I really should have cut some, cut these out. Once, yeah. once the gem counter was done, I really should have. Yeah. But hey, at least that's two talismans now. And now we're gonna go to go to the Colossus for our third. And holy shit, a stage I can one hundred percent. Hallelujah. <laughs> Yeah, if you kind of look at it, you can't 100%... Well, okay. You can 100%... You can 100% Idle Springs if you get swim... If you go to Colossus first. Mm -hmm. I don't because level order. 
But still, it's like. Ah, oh, it's the Eddie. It's like. I don't like the, the like, new. What the hell, man? I don't like the new chanting tune. I don't like yeah. it. I prefer. Yeah. And they also just showed me. Oh. They also just had a guy just get eaten by a yeti. Yep. Yeah. A yeti has been rampaging around our home, but we've managed to trap him by shutting all the doors. If you talk to the other brothers, they will open the gates and guide you to him. <laughs> Shiny gems. <laughs> Forget the talisman for this level. You just have to make it safely to the exit. So basically, the just exit. do the same. Just do the same thing I've been doing. Smart yeah. ass. Have you ever actually gone off to that the, that cliff right there? By concentrating, I, I think once maybe. Oh my, of course you have. I love that for the for the Buddha statues, they had added they had they added hockey sticks. It's yeah. like why are there hockey sticks here? It's funny though. It is, it is. It's it definitely is. funny. Poor penguin. We need keys when you know how to chant penguins. How am I supposed to achieve enlightenment if you keep pestering me? Fuck you. <laughs> Wow. Yeah, I, I never never talked to the, to the first guy. I'm trying to help you, and that's how you, like, respond. No, you're not. You're just standing there like a dumbass. Oh. It's like, Christ. I will admit, I think my favorite, um... Rendition of monks mm -hmm. are those one monks from Futurama. Oh, oh, oh! The one where Bender gets shot um, into space and ends up becoming God to a bunch of small people who okay, end okay. up dying. Because... From there, I thought you were gonna talk about. Yeah. From there, I thought you were gonna talk about, like you were talking about like the Martians. Oh. Um, like remember. from that episode, from that episode, um, where the bungalow roam. Oh, those, like, like, no, no, those are Indians. Those are Indians. Yeah, yeah, sir. Like they're, they're well, Native like, Americans. They were Native actually Amer doing, like, Native Americans. I apologize. Yeah, yeah no, you know, that's what yeah, those they are. were. Um, yeah, they were doing like a throat singing. Yeah. And that's like John DiMaggio, Billy West. I can't remember who else, but they're, they're doing the throat singing for like the Martians. Like that part is <laughs> cool. But no, I'm no the one where Bender becomes god to a bunch of small people on people that end up dying oh, yeah. because he, he has this, like he has a yeah. bunch of nu nukes hidden in his butt. How can you be sure I really yeah, yeah. Know? It's like oh great, they reached like they reached like my um. Oh no, like, they found the nuclear weapons in on my ass. <laughs> Look, Daddy, I'm hugging hugging God real tight. If I hug him up, he will. <laughs> No. Yeah. <laughs> Interesting note. In one of the demos I used to own of the original, Zoe goes, remember the hunter's advice. Mm -hmm. And it's like, where did the the come from? Why? Yeah. Well, I think he was originally supposed to be referred to as the hunter, maybe. Maybe. Yeah. Yeah, no, it's like, 
Get loose out! We need our shoes, both our shoes need him, now we're bored! Even though I'm a vegetarian, I think you should torch that yeti. Honestly, that's one of my favorite Futurama episodes, just because <laughs> of the lengths that Fry went through to try and find Bender. Oh boy, it's time for our first boss fight! <laughs> well, boss on, defeated! Wow, that was the easiest <laughs> boss battle ever. No, that, that was that was like, the I video thought... game equivalent to um, the guy with the sword from um, from um, from um, mm-hmm. Raiders of the Lost Ark. Yeah. You know, yeah, you know, the guy that. just does all this fancy yeah. fancy sword work. Then just and he just pulls pulls out a gun and just shoots him. Shoots him. Yep. You know you you know the truth of that um, scene, right? Uh no I don't. The cast and crew were basically had food poisoning and so basically Harrison oh. just pulls out the gun and shoots the guy instead of just having an elaborate fight scene <laughs> because he was part because he was because he was sick Ooh. I don't understand what like, that track is that for shit. by the way welcome oh we that's fine found that hockey is a peaceful and calming sport great game Reese great game Bart <laughs> I've never been so proud of them. <laughs> They're both losers! Losers! Rip off! We paid for blood! Let's tear this place apart! Good idea! Ah! Would you like to join Hockey me? as a peaceful and calming sport? Okay, brother Kip. Kip, Kip, Kip. Come to Canada. Hockey here is brutal, bitch. Don't give me this old hockey is calm and peaceful shit. No, you know, no, no, no. You know, I could just find a clip. The um, I'm gonna just ro just rotate my arms, and if you get in my way, um, it's your own fault. <laughs> well, I'm just gonna kick the air. Uh. I can find that for you later if you want to add that in. Yes, please. Okay. For those that don't watch The Simpsons, that's, that's, that's the, the context of that is the episode's called Lisa on Ice, so it's an episode about hockey. Yeah. And as people have known before, like, people know that I am actually Canadian, and so I found that response about how hockey is, you know, calm and peaceful. That's bullshit. Like, hell no. <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah. There actually hockey was a, a brutal sport. There, there actually was a um, hockey player who who got refused an autograph by by one of the players, and basically when he became a hockey player four mm -hmm. years later, he was playing against the guy who refused the autograph. He just went out, and just picked the fight on the ice with him. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah. I I love that story. I love that story. Okay. Um. Remind me later to send you a song from my favorite comedy Canadian group, The Arrogant Worms. Okay. They did a song called They did a song called yes. Me Like Hockey. Okay. Send it send it when we're done recording this episode and I'll give it a listen. Yeah, yeah. It's it's one of my favorite Arrogant Worms songs. I believe this is a I'll probably um, say, yeah. I believe this is the first of the few um shooting at the red goal. Skill points I do get, because so I know there are a few. Yeah. And for in the case of this one, it's just basically perfect. This game. Don't let the other guy uh -huh. get us get us get a uh, goal. Dice physics are not bad. But yeah, there's still ice physics. No one likes ice physics. 
Of, mm-hmm. of course, we laugh. We're gonna laugh at Edgy because he has to do snow, <laughs> snow, a uh, cold hard crash and crash too. <laughs> so he has to deal uh, with the worst of the, where the worst ice physics ever. We're just gonna get that like image of SpongeBob laughing equally, aren't we? <laughs> just, like, the thumbs behind him. <laughs> and yes, if the if the polar bear does hit him. Hit you, you do spit the puck out. Okay, see, I didn't know that you could actually flame. <laughs> I didn't know yeah, that, like, see, I do get it point. as a... Well but if you stare at it long enough, you might not, enough, see, you might not see anything. Okay. Huh? Okay, so I have to ask, since you said that. How hard did you? Ha- how much of a hard time of the, that 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 mission did you have? Keep in mind, I was a kid when I played. I, I know that, but still, it's like how hard of a mission so did you have I think it, for that? I think it took me like four tries. Huh? Yeah, I wasn't like that much of a gamer as a kid, but like as no. I am now. True. So like that's that's one of the reasons, but <sighs> I like. I know, I know, I know. I'm not, I'm not. I was just judging yeah. you for that. I was actually just curious. Oh, I know, I know, I know, because like no one, yeah. Thank goodness you Hi, Professor. Away, but now it will hide what are you doing here? If you were to flame all ten statues, that is a really good question. I what remember. the hell, hell is he doing here? Also, <laughs> three stars. This is not that hard of a commission. If you want to get rid this of is yes. one or two. You must flame all the statues. Yeah. Yeah, they turn the yeah the statues turn the hockey sticks into swords. And I just love that change. It's kind of funny. It is. Yeah. It's funny. It's like, Arr. I mean, they look they look but, better in this than they do in the in the original one, which just which they just like. I think they put their put the hands up in the in the original. Yeah. I don't understand why that. Yeah. Why my the flames didn't free those statues. I also don't understand why it took me three flames for that one. <laughs> I'll get that get that chest eventually. 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 Uh. Uh, uh. <laughs> I was like, we both just quote. Episodes. We just both just quote. You idiot! Why did you not go for the one that's over there? Oh right, I'm going for the gems and the and the rocket. I'm calling yourself a dude? I can get behind this. Fuck you. Maybe later. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. You're the one that started it, so. <laughs> boing, boing. If you were playing Crash, I'm pretty sure you would add that um, sound clip to whenever you do, you were doing a... Um, a yep. box break, a box jumping challenge. Yep, definitely, definitely, I would definitely. But you're not, it, so it's edgy. Yep. You better add that in. No, 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 no. I doubt him. He'll he'll do it. Mm-hmm. And. And there's the quest done. Like I said, that's not a three. That's not a three. That's that's a two at most. 
some of the rankings for the quests are just weird. I'm glad that evil spirit is gone. It is giving me the heebie-jeebies. Oh, hmm. orbs collected. And level 100% complete. 100% level. Yeah. Holy shit, All I actually, actually 100% of the Spyro, Spyro 2 level. It took me two episodes. Like, in the latter, latter half of, get to the, of the second one, we go. How'd they get that into the where, where the professor was? They lifted it. Uh, keep in mind, like, there's an entrance lifted up. I don't know. It's like, no, you're doing it wrong. Like this, like this. Oh, yeah. And he murdered and a man. <laughs> he murdered his sensei. Colossus, <laughs> where, where people go to die. <laughs> Hockey games, goats feeding people to yetis, crushing people. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but okay, I guess that's it for this like, week, this episode. Yeah, no, <laughs> no, it is. Oh man, I, seriously, seriously, there is some worse levels in here in the in this game when it comes to mm -hmm. basically livelihoods. Which, like Colossus, you would think that is mm -hmm. is one of the safest. No, it's not. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Granted, it's not as safe as the place with is the literal volcano, or what you see on on the right of the ending mm -hmm. screen.